Hello, champions, and welcome to our Sunday celebration. I'm so glad to see you guys again. And for those that are tuning in online, thank you so much for uh, spending time with us. And don't forget to type down below where you're watching from. And also share what God has encouraged you to throughout the week. All right. And feel free to share that, this broadcast to your friends and family. Um, before we begin, I have a couple of announcements today. Um, the first is uh, Champion Life Center always wants you to be part of the community. And so if you haven't been part of a life group, you may simply just go online and you can find information there to register for a life group. Or you can also register through our mobile app. Um, next is for those who have kids between ages 4 to 12, we have Sunday school online from 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. And so if you want to register your child, uh, please go online and you can find information to do so. Also, I uh, just want to congratulate um, the Champion Kids Ministry for having a successful vacation Bible school for the past three days. So let's all just give them a round of applause. Let's all praise God for those that have sacrificed their time, effort, strength. Um, thank you so much. And for those, for the parents that have trusted us, their kids, we thank you for, for that. Um, we also have our, our youth uh, connect every Fridays. And if you want to find more information on how to join, uh, please simply follow their Instagram account, at ZLYM. Um, and as we know, CLC is a family. And if you want to be prayed for or you want someone to be prayed for, you can simply go online and fill up our prayer request form and we would connect with you and we would happily pray for you. And with that, don't, please don't forget to follow all our social media accounts to stay updated with what's happening in our CLC community. Amen. So right now, it is our time uh, for giving. And it's a great way to just obey God's principles to give and to really be a blessing as he blesses us. And so we have different ways to give. You can text to give. Give through our website, our mobile app, or e-transfer your giving. Uh, just make sure you put the location of the campus you're giving to. All right. May God bless you to give. And let's all stand as we just pray for our tithes and offerings. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much today. We celebrate your goodness. We celebrate your love for us, Father. We thank you for giving us a wonderful Sunday, Father. We thank you, Lord, for blessing us uh, with resources, Lord, that we can use in our daily lives. Thank you for never failing us. You never failed to provide for us, Father. Lord, I pray that you would use uh, these offerings, Lord, for the advancement of your kingdom. Lord, for just the glorification of your name. Uh, we lift it up to you. We take no um, credit for this. This is all yours, and may your name be glorified, and may you be pleased. In Jesus' name, amen. Now let's prepare our hearts as we lift up Jesus and sing songs to worship him. Good afternoon, church. Psalm 104 and 5 say, Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his love is eternal and his faithfulness endures to all generations. Our God is so good and he looks at us and he pours out his love and his goodness to us no matter what we've done or no matter what we are doing. But God is so good and he is faithful. So let's give him praise for he deserves the glory.
his love to you, not because it will make you happy, but because you deserve it. And that's because that's who he is. And he just wants to love on you and to just overflow through you in extravagant ways. So today as we sing this song, let's just reflect on what God has done in your life, how he's been faithful to you, how he's provided for you, how he's forgiven you, and how he's seen you through in all of your circumstances. Jesus, you are so good. You are so good, God. Even when we don't deserve it, God, you've been there for us.
existence in our lives, in our families, God, in our circumstances, oh God, that no matter what, oh Lord, we're, we're going through, Lord, we are not wavering because we know you are powerful and we know that you are in control for you are a big God. We thank you, Lord for the word that comes from you today. And as we open up our hearts, I pray that, Lord, that our lives will be transformed, that our ears will hear your voice loudly and clearly, Father, that we will, Lord, leave this place changed and transformed, Father. We thank you for who you are and for what you are in our lives. In Jesus' name. 